waterfront market opened in Dubai a little over 12 months ago. Today, it's home to the fish market and the fresh foods market. We visit it to understand how it's managed and how the FM operations are carried out on a day-to-day -day basis. So, from 13 months ago today, a lot's changed just around the number of cleaners and how we utilize them, how we utilize our security, definitely around how we, we look at our back of house. You know, we made a lot more steps forward in, you know, being greener. You know, we look to recycle wherever we can. We're looking at using salt water instead of fresh. Definitely economised on our lights. I, I think uh, when we first opened, you, you would have seen this building from space. We're all lit up. You just compare it from all the, all the fish market and what we are in current. It's really it is a big change, you know. So, as, we, as Mr. Gatan will say, yes, it is a new things for us. We are learning every day from something is new. Uh, yes, we face a lot of challenge and we try to solve it daily by, on, on daily basis. Imdad is responsible for the integrated facilities management at the site. And Itra says that it shares a very close working relationship with its third party FM service provider. It's like any property, you know, even though you say it's an outsourced function or you, you name it separately, it still has to work locked in with the rest of the team. So, you know, Ali and the team, they, we're having daily meetings, daily formal meetings with our service providers. We want to be world class, so everything we do has yeah. to be world class. So we work closely with our, with our, you know, with the, with the FM team, both hard and soft and the security teams to really ensure that we are getting best in practice service. It's the customers that come in and buy the meat and the fruit and vegetables and the fish that, you know, they're the reason we're here. Without them, there's no point. So we've got a big wholesale auction that runs every night, um, and then we've got the front of the house. So there's a lot of, lot of moving parts. So what are the aspirations for the waterfront market? Well, as always, in true Dubai fashion, they plan to be the best in the world. When people talk about world-class markets, they talk about, you know, they talk about Seattle, Sydney, um, Tokyo. That's a prime example. So, look, you know, from a from an FM cleanliness operational point of view, um, I think we're well on the way to getting to that level. The trick for us is to produce that sort of world class in, in this region. You know, we don't want to mimic another, um, you know, one of the other. Like we don't want to, we're not never going to be the same as Tokyo because the customer is different. How far have we got to go? To be honest, I'd say we'll probably never get there if we're really honest because our, our customer keeps evolving. As always, Chef Mohammed Bin Rashid saying that, that to be a star or to be a different, there is no end, you know. So of course we want to uh, show this building or this concert to the world, you know. And, uh, and we want also as Emirati, tomorrow uh, everyone come to uh, this market to take this idea from us and maybe implement it somewhere in some world, you know.